Hey guys, welcome to a guide for farming the Black Armory Papers, aka the new lore entries added with the annual pass. Big thanks to user Tim Booten or Tim Boten, who told me about this method in the comments of my previous video. Without him, I wouldn't have even known this was possible. Also, this farming method doesn't require any crazy things, like you don't have to change the time of your console or jump through any hoops to get these lore entries. And to my knowledge, this can be done on any platform. So, starting off, what you'll need to do is drop your power level as much as possible. You can do this many different ways. You can use a mask from Festival of the Lost in your collections. You can use Eververse armor you've collected that's at 10 power. You can buy weapons and armor from Hawthorne that's 200 power. You can use old weapons from your vault that you never leveled up. And you can also buy engrams from the Crypt Dark. I think they drop around 380. There's not a specific level you have to drop down to, but I'd recommend getting as low as humanly possible, at least around 250 or lower preferably, just to be safe, but I'm sure you could get away with higher. Once you're a low enough level, all you have to do is head to Nessus and load up the Gofanon Forge. Now the way this works is because you're such a low level, the game will refuse to matchmake you with people who are actually doing these forges legit. The game will end up doing one of two things. It will either match make you with people who are super low level like you and doing the exact same thing to farm this forge, or it will send you into your own private session. Either outcome doesn't actually hurt anyone who's doing this legitimately since you'll never be match made with people who are in the 500s or 600s, only people who are very low level like yourself. And once you've loaded into GoFanon, you can put your controller down and let the game play itself. The timer will run out and every time the forge ends, you have a chance at getting one of these lower entries. It seems they only really drop in GoFanon since I've done mostly Volunder and Izanami completions since the papers were unlocked and I haven't gotten a single one until I started this GoFanon farm. So as long as you have this forge unlocked, which if you don't know how to unlock it, I'll link a guide in the description, and have a low power level and you can simply leave your game on overnight if you want and get all of the lore. As you can see, I've sped up the footage to show you what it's like, and I actually got a few lore entries during this short capture, and while I'm recording this, my game is actually running in the background, so it's a great efficient method, and the best part is you're not harming anyone who's trying to do the activity legit, and you don't have to do anything. The game won't kick you for being AFK because the rounds are only like a minute long, so unless you lose connection to the internet or turn off your game of course, you can just sit there forever and get lore entries from this farm. Hopefully this was helpful. If you want to know how to farm some other lore entries in the game, check my playlist that's in the outro or description. This week the Tangled Shore is the current flashpoint, so that should allow you to get some Varix lore. I have a video on that, and of course I'll keep the playlist updated anytime I release a new video on how to farm some lore. Thank you very much for watching everyone, I hope you enjoyed the video, and have a great day.